conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And our live game is Lorient against Stade René. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. So empty, I'm receding And all of my friends are misplaced Been in circles several days Never knowing the right way mm, yeah So And we're underway Try all And it's Niang, Grenier, Panu passes it through, Niang, big chance! Gets it upfield, Martin, De Silva, Grenier, tries to switch the play. Put a stop to that. The one. This game is in need of some excitement. It needs help, and it's down to the creative and striking talent to up their game and, and give this crowd something to cheer about. Goes wide. How about it? Aim forward. Yang makes himself available. Pereira. Acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The idea was good though, Peter, and I like the run that triggered the pass, but the quality was the problem. Gomis. So what now? Has gone out. Yang, well positioned to make that interception. Le one. The Bwemba. Aimed long and direct. Tries to stroke it through. Martin. Still waiting for the first goal. Martin boots it upfield. Looks to slip it through. He's still going. Where to next? Spoon forward. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? And there's the end of the first half. Some first half thoughts. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully they've been saved for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more energy and invention early on. Martin. Wemba. With a good steal, well played. And it's Niang. And the counter is on. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, that's that's true. And is that how you're seeing it? 
Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. second half and it's still goalless Pereira danger averted for now it's going to be another throw Made certain that won't get through. Keeper's got good distance on that. Panu pulls it over to the other flank. Looks like a good ball through. Stad Rene are not functioning with the cutting edge they need. We're seeing too much passing and not enough reward. It's time for more drive and certainly for more penetration. Pereira is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Yeah, better communication and, and lots of contact seems to be the, the route to quietening him down now. Martin gets his foot in there. Martin did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Pumps it upfield. And it's Niang. Steered out wide. Martin. And he's there to hoof it away. Big chance! And another time! They've scored! Well, if ever there was a perfect time to score, I think we just witnessed it. Oh, whose goal is that? Big deflection. That's one for the dubious goals panel. That Rene take the lead. Now it's just a question of holding on. Well, look, Peter, I feel I've got to stress that there's still time for another, so we can't be too presumptuous yet. The final whistle. One goal settled it. A tense and exciting game that just got.